اعوذ باللہ من الشیطان الرجیم بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم In this session, we are going to look into how to use a categorical independent variable with two categories in a mediation relationship. In this particular example, I've got the type variable, which is the type of organization. Is it public sector organization or private sector organization? Where zero identifies the public sector organization and one is for private sector organization. And that influences the organizational commitment leading to collaborative culture. Now, what I propose here is that whether organizational commitment mediates the relationship between the type of organization and collaborative culture. Now, in order to do so, what I'm going to do is I'm just going to go here, calculate and run bootstrapping. Now, before we run bootstrapping, we have to run the PLS SCM algorithm in order to understand whether our constructs are reliable and valid. Now in this case, since I've got a categorical predictor here, when I'm running the PLS SCM algorithm to assess the measurement model, I'm not going to include this variable in the analysis of the measurement model. I can do it with just these two variables. Those are my latent unobserved variables with different indicators like this. Now, in this case, I'm not interested in assessing the measurement model for that for other videos on the channel. Now I'm interested in just assessing the mediating role of organizational commitment in the relationship of type of organization and the collaborative culture. To do so, I'm just going to go to calculate, bootstrapping, 10,000, bias corrected. Let's go for one tailed or rather let's keep it two tailed. We are going to go for one tailed if I have the direction of relationship. So let's say I'm saying that the public sector organizations or the employees in public sector organization have higher level of commitment. So in this case, I'm going to use one tailed. And on the other hand, I'm saying that organizational commitment leads to improved collaborative culture. Now I'm giving the direction to my relationships. So I'm going to use one tail. Let's use one tail here. But if I'm not sure about the direction of relationship, let's say I'm not sure whether public or private organizations have higher organization. And I'm not sure whether increasing organizational commitment leads to improvement in collaborative culture or whether it decreases collaborative culture. Although literature would support an increase. But in this case, let's assume we know the direction of relationships and we are going to use one tail. Let's start. Now we'll go to the path coefficients. And if you look here, the impact of organizational commitment on collaborative culture is positive and significant. This means if you increase organizational commitment, that leads to increase in collaborative culture. But in this case, I'm not. Although I'm interested in assessing the direct relationship, but not at first, I'm interested in the mediating role. So where is my mediation? And here are my mediation results. And there is a significant mediation and it is negative. So what do we mean by this negative here? We come back here. Just to summarize again, this is significant mediation. So organizational commitment mediates the relationship between the type of organization and collaborative culture. Now, what type of organization? Let's go back here, path coefficients. And if you look here, there is a negative sign here. What do we mean by this negative sign? Now, this negative sign here points to the lower category, in this case, public sector organization. So organizational commitment of public sector organization is higher in comparison to the organizational commitment of private sector organizations. So in summary, the commitment or organizational commitment of employees of public sector organization is higher in comparison to those working in private sector organizations. Why am I saying that? Because there is a negative sign. The negative sign points to the lower category. So the type of organization leads to organizational commitment is the public sector organization. And organizational commitment is leading to improved collaborative culture. Both are significant and we found that specific indirect effects were also significant.
This way, we have substantiated our hypothesis that organizational commitment mediates the relationship between the type of organization and collaborative culture. And in this case, the type of organization that leads to better organizational commitment is public sector organization. Thank you very much.